In today's how-to video, we will show the installation of the new SpeedMe multi-guide. To do so, we need the following materials. Please pause the video at any time if you need to. The SpeedMe multi-guide can be installed in SpeedMe Fiber and Arrow Tools. It allows SpeedMe Fiber duals to use 1.1 mm SpeedMe arrows, enhancing the sensitivity and robustness of the analytical workflow without any changes in the method. This upgrade does not require any extra modules or tools. Installed in SpeedMe Arrow Tools, it opens up workflows by allowing the utilization of the agitator. Additional modules such as the heat text stir can still be used but are optional. Before changing the guide, remove any consumable that is still in the tool. Use the T8 screwdriver to unscrew the guide screw. Keep a firm grip around the tool and be mindful about the parts that are moving. Once removed, place the screw in a safe place as you will need it later again. Loosen the current guide from its position and set it aside. Next, place the spring of the SpeedMe multi-guide. Ensure that the SpeedMe multi-guide is aligned with the form of the hole and the tool. It fits in one direction only. Now use the old screw to keep everything secure. Finally, place the 1.1 mm SpeedMe arrow into the tool. Pay attention that the needle is entering the guide smoothly. Congratulations, your SpeedMe Fiber Dual can now be used with SpeedMe arrows. Please note that you will need to adjust the GC inlet too, as well as review method parameters such as injection penetration depth, desorption time, and maximum SpeedMe penetration. For more information, do not hesitate and reach out or search for additional resources in the content hub. There you can find application notes, installation guides, as well as scripts and methods.